Hi, it's Chester Topple at Blue Pecan Computer Training. And in this video, we're gonna look at how to format numbers in a VBA message box. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna play this little macro for you and show you how the message box looks without any number formatting. A simple little uh, sub procedure here. It's gonna ask me what my name is. So my name is Chester. And then it asks me for my date of birth. Let's say it's the 1st of April, 1972. Click on OK. And what it does is just return this message box. Hello, Chester. You were born on the 4th, uh, the 1st of April, 1972, and you are 48.69167 years old. So you can see the problem. We need to do a little bit of formatting here. I'm going to format the date. So it says the day of the week, for example. Might be nice to know what day you were born on. And also just format this with kind of one decimal place. So how do I do that? Well, I'll just comment out this line that creates the message box so far. This is the line of code that includes the formatting. It's really quite simple to do. What you do is you use format. Now format has two arguments uh, that you're gonna to need to be uh, worried about in this context. One is the actual value that you want to format, and then the second is the format you want to apply to that value. So for example, with the user date of birth, that's a variable name, um, and that has been collected up here. So the user date of birth, and what I've used is this format here, and you can see it's in quotation marks. Now these formats you can get within Excel. Let me just show you. If I go to home, and I, well, what I normally do is right click on format cells or I can use the shortcut key control one and that brings up this dialog box and if you go to custom here you can see all these formats here can be used within those quotation marks within your VBA and I'm using date format so you've got D for day, M for month, Y for year is our VBA screen so uh, I'm DD, I'm using D, four Ds there to return the name of the day of the week, then the month, uh, then the uh, number of the day, then the month, and then the year. So then I go on to formatting the user age. So the user age is calculated here using the year frac function stored in a variable called user age. And that's the format I want to apply. So it's a number with one decimal point. So if I, one decimal place. So if I play this, Put in the same name, Chester, and the same my date of birth is the 1st of April 1972, same as before. Click on OK, and here we are. Hello, Chester, you were born on Saturday, the 1st of April 1972, and you're 48.7 years old. So that's all because I've used format here. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this video. Hopefully you found it useful. Please subscribe if you have, and I'll see you next video.